Hello and welcome to Spotlight on Richardson ISD. I'm Justin Bono, a member of the RISD Board of Trustees, and it is my pleasure to introduce this month's highlights from across the district. Fans of the Richardson ISD Environmental Study Center celebrated its 40th anniversary last month with an open house. Parents, district alumni, joint founders, and supporters to celebrate the facility, which provides a unique learning environment to explore scientific concepts in a natural setting through direct experience. Over 20,000 students in grades K-5 through visit the center each year. For more information about what the ESC offers to our students and the community, please watch the ESC video on RISD's YouTube channel. The RISD Prize Patrol was back on the road again and surprised math, science, and technology magnet sixth grade teacher Stacy Menifee with this year's Fujitsu Teacher Trailblazer Award. Established by Fujitsu Network Communications in 2010, the award honors a teacher in grades K through six who integrates creative and innovative use of technology as part of the instruction process and uses innovative techniques to challenge students. And the prizes didn't stop there. Two STEM teaching awards were designated in partnership with the Texas Instruments Foundation. The first stop was made at Carrie Galvan's anatomy classroom at Berkner High School, followed by a visit to Mark Mester's automotive bays at Richardson High School. Two RISD secondary teachers are selected through a competitive process each year. The award honors instructors who are working to enhance student achievement in STEM through innovative teaching methods and use of technology. The arts were in full bloom at the district's Professional Development Center in March during the Youth Art Month exhibition and reception. The event emphasized the value of art education for all children and encourage support for quality school art programs. Artwork was submitted from each of RISD's 55 campuses. Parents, students, and community members were invited to experience the student creations and interact with the artist. Walk-up workshop tables, interactive studio displays, and a college and career art corner encouraged guests to experience opportunities in the arts after high school. Moss Haven Elementary celebrated its fourth growing season at its school farm on March 27th. The campus proudly partnered with the U.S. Department of Agriculture to launch culinary and history beds with an additional water harvest system. Students planted spring crops and acknowledged Moss Haven Farm partners. Plains Capital Bank, American Heart Association, United Way Dallas, Cooper Institute, Fuel Up to Play 60, Dallas County Master Gardeners, Dairy Max, and Whole Foods Park Lane. In addition to lessons in sustainability and healthy eating by working the urban farm, the school works with the North Texas Food Bank to teach students the value of giving back to the less fortunate. Meet the teacher! My name is Jordan Taub and I teach first through sixth grade art at RASD Academy. The fourth graders at RASD Academy are learning about the history, influence, and evolution of printmaking, from the wooden Japanese block print, to the printing press, to the present. My students are working in teams to create a series of mono prints. Each team is provided a reusable jelly printing plate, acrylic paints, and a collection of objects. Unlike block prints that are reusable, each mono print pulled from a plate is not an identical reproduction. The teams work together to identify the best way to lay paint onto the surface of the plate and how to subtract paint using the objects. In this classroom, we are constantly evolving and feeding off of one another's ideas. I am creating innovators, providing the tools necessary to create and identify things we don't even know exist yet. I am a proud alumna of RASD, and I can say that the arts absolutely matter. My art classroom becomes a safe haven where students interact, dream, create, and inspire each other to prepare for their global future. The Richardson ISD Council of PTAs gave away 80 car seats to RISD families at its annual safety event. Trainers from Parkland Injury Department and Dallas Police showed recipient families how to properly install and use the seats. Infants through seven-year-olds were served this year. Now in its 10th year, the program coordinators work with school principals and counselors to give car seats and safety training to families 
that could not otherwise afford a car seat. Prairie Creek Elementary alumna and author Michelle Staubach Grimes shared her children's book, Where is Pidge, with students and staff. Staubach Grimes was joined by parents Roger and Marianne Staubach for the event. The author shared her process of writing a book with students. Several RISD facilities celebrated milestone anniversaries this spring, including Mohawk Elementary and West Junior High. On Saturday, April 11th, Mohawk celebrated 50 years of educating children, emphasizing time and trends with the opening of one time capsule and the sealing of another. And there is an overwhelming um, repetition of Ninja Turtles, New Kids on the Block, Soccer, and Vanilla Ice. Those were the really popular things apparently in 1991. Current students resealed the time capsule for the class of 2035. A copy of Frozen, a first-generation iPhone with pictures on it, and much more were included for future Mohawk students. Inflatables as well as band, orchestra, and choir performances added exciting sights and sounds. Richardson West Junior High celebrated five decades of excellence in education on Saturday, April 18th. The community-wide event kicked off with a 5K run, followed by the carnival-style Bronco Bash. During the celebration, visitors enjoyed student performances, campus tours, plenty of games, and a memorabilia museum. Cooper Aerobics Center sponsored the event. Thank you for joining us for the April Spotlight on Richardson ISD.